What's up, everybody, man? It's your boy, Mr. Dugar, coming at y'all with another video, man. <laughs> and today, man, I'm going to talk about yesterday's basketball game. You had the number 19 ranked LSU Tigers beating the Georgia Bulldogs on the road, 83 to 79, to improve to 21 and 4 overall and 11 and 1 in the SEC. Uh, first off, I'm sorry I'm kind of late with this video, man. Had some um. Had family issues going on yesterday, man. We unfortunately had a death in the family. But, um, you know, all is well. Appreciate, you know, the prayers for the family and everything. But, um, yeah, man, uh, good win on the road, man. It wasn't pretty. It was pretty sloppy early on, which you kind of had to expect coming off of such a huge win on the road against Kentucky, which that, look, look, that win looks even better now the way they took apart number one Tennessee last night. But um, coming off of an emotional win like that, man, going on the road against a team you clearly know you better than, you clearly should beat, you know, you kind of expected us to be a little sloppy, at least early on, and we was, where this game was very competitive, man. Um, But shout out early on, man, Tremont Waters did his thing, really got going for us early on. And in the second half, we led to um Javante Smart, man, who um had a career-high 19 points. You know, Tremont had his 20. Um, the guy from Georgia, Claxton, had a big game as he pulled in 17. Um, like I said, we Georgia shot the ball well early on, got a bunch of – they kind of was beating us at our own game, getting a lot of second-chance points, uh, especially in that first half and early in the second half. But then we started to settle in. We started to play good defensively, got our rebounds and made our free throws down the stretch to pull out the four-point win. Um, you you look at Georgia's record, you know, they 10 and 15 overall, one and uh 11 in the SEC, and you'll be like, oh, why we only one by four? Man, let me tell you, man, that's a nice win for our team yesterday, man. Going on the road, it's tough on the road. To say that team is one and ten, that that arena was sold out and very loud, man. You know, shout out to their fans for that. But uh big win, yo. Big win now with Tennessee losing. We are tied with Tennessee on top of the SEC as both of us are 11 and 1 going into the colossal showdown next Saturday at the PMAC between the 11 and 1 at SEC Tennessee and 11 and 1 SEC LSU. You know, we got a big game Wednesday. Um, we got the Florida Gators coming to town. We got to handle business against them to prepare for the big game with Tennessee. Um, due to the, uh, the unfortunate death in the family, I won't be able to be at that LSU Tennessee game uh, next Saturday. But um, I'm looking, I'm gonna try to make it to that LSU Vanderbilt game uh, later on this season at home. Uh, I'm gonna try to be to that game where if any of you guys are going out there, I'll try to meet y'all, you know, so we could chat and everything. But um, yeah, the the, the LSU Tennessee uh, video Saturday gonna probably be on Sunday. You know, since I'm going to have a lot going on Saturday with a uh, funeral and everything. But, uh, yeah, man, um, big win for the Tigers, man. Big win. You know, going on the road, getting the win to improve to 11. This is a good basketball team, man. This is a very good basketball team. And I'm curious to see where we're going to be ranked when the rankings come out Monday because that win against Kentucky is a big win, man. If anybody try to, like, downplay it or whatever, when you see the way they played against Tennessee, that should just in alone boost up our rankings a little bit. I I'm pretty sure we're going to be top 15, but I want to see how, how high we go up this week when the rankings come out. And like I said, big, big win, big win, man. Um, on the road, I, granted, it wasn't a great opponent, but it's on the road. You know, coming off of an emotional win is easy. Human nature would easily, easily allow you to have a letdown in a game like that yesterday. And for the most part, it kind of did. Like I said, we were stagnant. But what's so good about this team, man, is we have so many different people we could go to. You know, in the backcourt, man, we got Tremont Waters. If he ain't got it going, we could go to Javante Smart. We could go to Skylar Mays. 
um, big man Don Lowe, we could go to Nas Reed, or like he proved against Kentucky, if he's in foul trouble, you know, Emmett Williams could come off of the bench and give us really good minutes, man. Um, Marlon Taylor is starting to is improving offensively, and he's a freakish athlete. Cavell Big Ben Williams um, doing his thing, rebounding, being just physical down low in, in the paint. This is a very good team, and not to mention they're very well coached, man. Will Wade and his staff has done an amazing job. I'm curious to see how how high will be ranked Monday and how far this team could could event if the, how this team could finish off in the SEC SEC tournament and the NCAA tournament. But um, but with that being said, man, that's all I got for y'all today. Appreciate y'all checking out the video. Go on, give me a subscribe, man. I'm gonna have LSU basketball content throughout the season. Y'all have a blessed one. Go Tigers.